Hey everybody. Today I'm gonna to be showing you one of my favorite vehicles I've ever owned. Truly top three best vehicles. This is the 1978 Chevrolet Suburban 4x4 with the Silverado package. My square body friends, you know how special this is. The 70s square bodies are my absolute favorite because I love the grill and the circular headlights. It's just timeless, it's classic, and to me they're the most beautiful of the square bodies. This 1978 Suburban is in the beautiful Mariner blue with the white two-tone combo going. It's got all the beautiful chrome bright work. It's got the hood ornament. Look at that, shining. It's got the tow mirrors. It's got the rally wheels. It's got the rear deflector. It's got the luggage rack. This was the most loaded out Suburban you could get. I mean, this one tops it all. Absolutely stunning. All the right equipment. I mean, this was back in the late 70s. This was the Range Rover. This was the Escalade. This was one of the most expensive SUVs money could get you. This right here. It's absolutely stunning. We put a two inch lift on it. We put brand new KO2s on there. The best part of all, we've done everything. I mean, this has been a true, complete restoration essentially. But the best part is that it has a brand new blueprint GM small block 355 that puts out 390 horsepower, 410 feet of torque. And I mean, this puppy goes aluminum heads. I mean, it is a great engine. It's the, I did a lot of research. It, everybody said to go with this engine. So blueprint does the best. And uh, that's what this has a brand new blueprint 355. So, you know, you're getting great horsepower, but you're also getting really good, much improved fuel economy, I should say. And there's no leaks, there's no drips, tons of power. We had the transmission rebuilt to match the new engine. I mean, the entire truck has just been gone through with a fine tooth comb. It's been a Georgia Suburban its entire life. Sold new in Marietta, Georgia, right outside Atlanta. I bought it from a friend of mine whose dad purchased it from the original owner in 1986. So his family had had it for about 35 years. It only had one repaint and back to factory original colors. Mariner blue, my favorite of the GM colors. Very, very rare. And also, I mean, it was four by four Suburbans in the seventies were very rare in general, but especially to get them loaded out with, you know, two-tone color, rally wheels, hood ornaments, roof racks, uh, rear deflectors, AM, FM radio, uh, AC. This one, was just macked out. It still has all the original soft ray glass, so the glass is totally original and in amazing shape. I did put new bumpers on it, so the bumpers are new just because the old ones just looked a little, you know, weathered. I wanted them to shine like the new, like the paint does. The paint's absolutely gorgeous. Again, the paint job, about 20 years old, but really top-notch quality. And I had my detailer do a wet sand buff on it and then we added a, um, a sealant. We did a ceramic, uh, ceramic coat on it to protect that paint. And that ceramic coat just gives it this beautiful gloss. I mean, 
this truck shines like no other. It just looks wet and slick at each turn. All the trim is original, which I'm, I was so glad about because the reproduction trim on these is terrible. So all original trim, again, all the glass is the original soft gray. All new bright work, new bumpers. And you gotta love the rally wheels on these Suburbans. Original tow mirrors, can Silverado package. Really, really beautiful truck. See there, the soft gray glass. It being a Georgia truck all its life, no rust issues. Really clean up under there. Not sure you can see or not. No drips, no leaks, nothing. Dual exhaust which puts out a beautiful note, not too loud, not too aggressive, but definitely lets people know that this is a boss and it's in charge. The stance on this Suburban is just perfect. You know, it being such a big, long SUV, the two inch lift I've found just matches a square body Suburban perfectly. I've done it to a few and I've owned a few square body Suburbans. This one is definitely the prettiest. I would say the most rare being a late 70s with all these options. Again, this was a very, very, very expensive SUV uh, back in 1978. This is my first time doing an engine swap on one. Um, my mechanic strongly suggested this blueprint engine and I'm so glad he did because when you drive this, you just, it, it's such a different experience with the power, the responsiveness, um, again, even just seeing the fuel eco uh, economy improve. Uh, it's, it's a modern day engine that, you know, this, this SUV really needed. The square bodies, they are hot, hot, hot. This is a classic. I can't wait to show you guys the interior. We had the interior completely redone back to factory standards. This truck looks like it did when it came off the line in 78. It's absolutely exquisite. It's a blast to drive. It gets all the attention. People go crazy when they see it. And um, can't wait to show you guys the interior and do a driving video.